Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Bo here from Guitars and Games. Welcome back into the channel. I'm glad you stopped in. We are going to watch another video and have a reaction today. We're going to watch Aurora walking in the air live at Nidaros Domen. Now, before anybody watches the video, this is not the one with the subtitles. I promise I didn't pick the one that has the subtitles. I swear. I understand that nobody wanted that for the last one. <laughs> so I didn't get the subtitles. We're all good with that. We're all good. Um, I hope everybody's having a great day. Yeah, the last video, everybody was like, oh my gosh, the big subtitles. And I was like, I'm sorry. <laughs> But yes, this one has no subtitles. Um, <laughs> I hope everybody's doing good. Thank you for coming in. I really appreciate it. We are grinding our way to a thousand subscribers. It's amazing. I'm happy. I'm glad you all are here. Um, thank you so much for coming and watching. Let's get into the video. So this is Walking in the Air. Ah, space background fitting. Ah, plans coming to fruition. No, all right, here we go. Her eyes are always so expressive. You know what I mean? Like her eyes just like when you like watch her singing. I mean, she, it, you know, I, I think I, I'm pretty sure I've said this before in another video. I mean, it's almost like she's kind of really like not even there. You know what I mean? She's in her song and she's in her lyrics. And I mean, of course, you know, this place, the Nidaros Dome, and I imagine the acoustics are sounding just outstanding. I mean, those old churches and stuff like that and cathedrals were built to, you know, amplify unmiked voices. So it works out really well. But yeah, let's see what the song, I don't know what the song's about yet. I haven't formed an opinion, but we'll see where it goes.
think this is about? I'm thinking it's so she's talking about floating above everything and looking down, seeing everybody, not seeing people, just observing, watching, judging, or like longingly, you know, like looking, hopefully, maybe? I don't know. Let's see where it goes. And the people far below, and they greet us as we fly. I'm holding very tight, so far across the midnight blue. Okay, one thing to point out about Aurora from that little note right there. <clears throat> Let's listen to it again. Watch her throat. Sorry. Here, watch, watch her throat. Like right here. On the sides. Did you see there was no tension in the throat? So she is able when that does what she, that does what she's able to do because of that because there's just no tension in her throat in her front you know none of the veins or cords muscle cords are standing out there's no movement any intake movement at all you know no you know like that you don't see it shooting up like her skin you know puckering a little bit because she's inhaling or forcing or bulging because she's forcing it's all just flat and calm like like a lake you know like a still lake and what she's that's what she's doing that i really like with her voice is when you can do that, when you're able to sing like that, like that powerful and that loud in this pure note, you know, you're not forcing it out, which means it the note has time to like build up resonance inside your lungs and inside your throat, in the back of your throat, because everything's relaxed. When you tense, it all clenches, you know, your muscles clench. So it compresses the like resonance chamber of your voice. And like she's able, cause she's so relaxed when she does that on her throat. It's just like building up that natural resonance in her before she releases the note out. And I mean, that just, it, that's why it like makes it, gives it like this weird kind of like, I know she probably has reverb, a little bit of reverb on her voice, because that's just how you do things. You always put reverb on the voice in a concert setting like that. But, I mean, that's just sound design that works. It doesn't change anything. It just kind of makes the voice seem a little bit echoey. A little bit. But, like, you get, like, this, like, breathy overtone to the note. Like, there's pure... It's like the note's pure and you have a haze of breath around the note that's also a note. I'm not explaining this very I'm not explaining this very well, but let's just finish out.
love how she always looks almost embarrassed when she's done singing the song. You know, it's just like, oh, I bear too much, you know. <laughs> But yeah, so it like gives her like this like breathy kind of overtone. It's not really an overtone, kind of a filtering, like a natural filter on her voice that kind of like, I don't know, it's just, it's very beautiful the way she sings. And you know, and I think, I think that song's about love. I mean, I know she's very adamant about people being able to, you know, I'm not getting into it, but just, you know, love who they love. That's great. I'm all for that. But, you know, love who you love, love whatever. But, like, I think the song is more like, you know, it's okay to be alone, too. And, like, it's okay. To, like, you have to be happy with yourself and love yourself before you can do anything else. But, like, when you do find somebody... You know, that you truly love. You can walk in the air, you know. You can do anything. And that's really a great feeling. It really is. And I mean, it, you know, some people don't want that. And that's fine. I don't think there should be any pressure to be in a relationship or be married or be committed to somebody. But if you do find it and it works and you really truly love that person you can walk in the air you know if you find your Alyosha Suzanne Sunfar then you know you can be it's an amazing feeling it really is oh well all right y'all I'm starting to get a little teary-eyed thinking about love. <laughs> I'm thinking about mm, my wife. <laughs> all right. Thank you all so much for coming in. I really do appreciate it. If you, you know, tell me what you think. Um, I hope you all have a great day. You know, like, comment, and subscribe if you would. I would appreciate it. Help the channel out so we can get keep going. All right. I hope you all have a great day. Thank you so much for coming. We're going to hit a 1,000 soon. I know it. So. Y'all have a great day, all right? I will see you all soon. Bye-bye.